everybody welcome to my channel I have got a hodgepodge of stuff another haul video so I everybody kept telling me they wanted to see haul videos and I almost never do them and I have been like so booked up with stuff that I needed to review and generally that's what happens I don't put them out what I buy because it's like stuff that is sent to me to review versus what I buy. You know, I have to post those videos. Ah, I've been on roll posting like crazy here lately. So, you know, I'm sure you're sick of seeing it or you've missed half of them. One or the other. I bought this stuff. I saw they had these little tabs, little um, sticky tabs that you can like swatch and put on the top of your polishes geez I need those for sure something I'm actually going to be using love it so I bought a couple plates I don't know that I'm gonna use these. hello these plates oh and my flash is not on what a huge help that is Skyline. Um, but I bought this plate this is M a 329 this is available to everyone and it is just oh, I love that it's just a um 60s peace man kind of plate retro if you will lots of flowers and smiley faces 60s, 70s kind of feel to me. Rainbows, flowers, happy, happy faces. Carla, your dad, it's your dad. Carla is my friend, and that's another story, but she doesn't even watch my channel, so. But anytime there's a smiley face, um, Carla and Jerry's dad. That's that's him saying hi. Hey, Paul. So that is super cute. I love the flowers. Love that. I saw these and thought, oh, I really like those. I need to get those. Right? Look at this. <laughs> um, I'm seeing, like... <laughs> Monty Python Holy Grail and the little cartoons in between each scene. <laughs> Rainbows and feet and crazy stuff in between. Comment below if that's your favorite movie ever. Monty Python the Holy Grail. Favorite movie ever. Um, also, love this. Peace and love. If only. Right? Peace and love, folks. Little butterfly. Uh, little little trip down trippy lane there. So cute. Okay, and that is M three three zero. Okay, on to polish pickup. Um, this was a, uh, like, a, what's it called? Throwback. This is Throwback 22. So, like, um, they asked makers to remake, like, their best-selling stuff from whatever month it was and do a throwback for July. Appreciate that so much because I missed this. And I missed this. I didn't get these two. Didn't know about this one. Now I do. Love it. This is the most gorgeous magnetic I have seen in a long time. And this is Watcha Nail Indie Polish. I don't know. I've never tried Watcha Nail. That's what I love about Polish Pickup and the Indie Box. Like, Indie makers that you didn't even know about that have awesome polish that you didn't even know about. That is a magnetic, and oh my gosh, you guys, 
That one is a beautiful look. I did a couple of just so beautiful. I mean, I can't. <laughs> this is so pretty. So pretty. I just did a straight up pull so that that looked like a gem, different shifting. That one I did not do anything at all to. And that one I also pulled out, hit the magnet, just kind of went around it to make that beautifulness. And then I have one here somewhere that I pulled a line on. Oh, no, I didn't, that one. Yeah, that kind of like did a double line. So gorgeous. <gasps> Love that one. Okay, so Adored Colors. Love her polishes. And this one has a little bit of reflective glitter in it. Not a lot, but just a little. This one glows in the dark. It's not dark right now. So, you know, this is going to be a little hard for me to show, but I do have a peel-off base coat on, so ignore the little bubbly bubble there. Uh, this was opaque in two coats. I do have it on all my nails. Oh, I should have done the other one on this nail since <laughs> I already have it, but I thought I'd show it to you. Um, Adored Colors Judinka with... Um, Judinka Nail Art. Judy with Judinka Nail Art is what I should be saying here. She makes polish and waxes and here's one coat. I have to remember how to do gel as opposed to regular polishes because that is a pretty thick coat, but opaque in two coats, positively. But it is a glow in the dark, and it is not dark here right now. But I will put up some pictures here at the end of this stuff glowing, because it's gorgeous. And then I went ahead and painted two layers of this. Look how gorgeous that is. Love this. This is hatched. Again, um, rogue lacquer. I don't have, I have zero rogue lacquer. That's something I'm going to need to check into because it's really pretty. Um, another good place to look for indie polishes, stuff that you don't normally see anywhere else. Lantern it and Wren. But this is just like a beautiful robin egg blue green kind of action going on with tons of gold flakies. This is such a pretty polish. I love this. And I did do some stamping and I'll put the picture up here. Um, I, I think I'm going to stamp, I don't know, maybe with this other, one of the maniology plates on, on this glow in the dark, but this is, um, a lantern and wren plate. Um, wildly beautiful is the name of this plate. I bought this because, oh, I don't know why I bought this. Why do you think I bought this? It's the only reason I bought this plate. But it has a couple of, like, framing images that you can stamp a little butterfly or bee in. Have a look at my nose. Really cute. What does that say? Um, be kind. I try. I really do. Strong is beautiful. Oh, I love the little book. I didn't notice that before. That's cute. Really cute images. A little puppy dog and some flowers. That looks like a gremlin. And some flowers, doesn't it? Hug maybe, I don't know. 
and some bees and some really cute honeycomb image. Oh, I didn't notice that's like a turtle flower. So, love that plate. Really cute. It has been like 500 degrees here a day. My husband has been working on the river. It's sprinkled, sprinkled today. And he's home, driving me nuts. Oh my gosh, I love this. Look how beautiful that is. I'm going to let that dry. Alright, so let's break these open. I know this, this video is going to be long, but... What else have we got to do, right? A whole bunch of them. And a whole bunch of stickies. So they are double-sided stickies, 3M. Ooh, fancy. Um, so you're gonna paint the nail, and then you're going to, on the back of it, then you're gonna let it dry and let the sticky Stick the sticky on it and then to the top of the there's a little bit of a well top of the bottle there's a little bit of a well in that I appreciate that and we're just gonna do that Ooh, cool all right we're gonna go ahead and use the glow in the dark that's so pretty. And it has like a little bit of a well to it. So I love that. You can kind of fill it up and I'll have to do two or three coats, whatever. going to set that down and let them dry and then I'll stick them to the tops. Okay so I really liked all of these polishes and these plates. I am using She Modern to just jazz these up a little bit so I can just show you a design over them. I really love She Modern stamping polishes because they're so sticky. I don't have to worry about my nails being completely dry and um, it stays sticky so you can just Pick off the extras that you don't need on your stamper with a scraping card, which is awesome. Um, what do you guys think of my background today? <laughs> it actually was raining really good. And so I just sat outside and recorded a little bit of it. It wasn't like thunderstorming or anything, but it was a really nice steady rain. I think I really like this one. I think it's a keeper. Oh, with the birds too. Oh, yeah. Okay, so um, go check out Polish Pickup for sure. It is available the first Friday of every month for like a couple of days. And I don't know if any of these rewind polishes are still available on like the individual sellers' websites. Go check those out if you're interested in any of them. You can't buy from Polish Pickup anymore for, for this month, for last month. So be aware of that. It only lasts for like three days. Same with the um, indie buyers, the indie box, um, those, you know, it's just really like, I just want you to open your minds to, to some indie brands because look how gorgeous that is. 
right? Love it. Um, so I love the little dots. The, these are going to come in extremely handy for me for swatching the top of polishes. Some of my polishes they won't sit on because they're an odd shape, but I can actually actually like them on the bottom because all my polishes are in shelves that are laying, they're laying on their sides, so I can put them on the bottoms maybe or sides. Anyway, this is so pretty. This one, um, a lot of her glow in the darks are UV activated. This one is not. I did use a UV light to take these pictures, but you absolutely don't have to. Um, I had forgotten about that I had this on and I went to bed and I was like, oh yeah, glow in the dark. So just regular light charges enough for it to glow at night. All right, you guys, um, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you like this background sound. Let me know down below if you do. Um, just some funky retro art there. And I'm taking pictures right now. <laughs> so you get the little swatcher of flume. Boom. I don't know what to call that. Um, boom. <laughs> Model poses. <laughs> All right. Thanks, you guys, so much for watching. Please use my code at Guiling325 at Maniology. And I got big news coming up about that. Bye. There is a skunk out here in my backyard. Ooh, I've never seen a skunk in my yard. Go away. Go away. Get out of here. Get out of here, skunk. Skunk out there, Penny. He needs to go away. Just never know what you're gonna see in my backyard out my dirty window. Look, Kimberly, I have a little squirrel friend eating the seeds out of the water. There's a little puddle there that the chickens dig up. Uh, having some snacks and washing him face. No skunk this morning, thank goodness. These are little yellow birdie. One of them. How old Mr. Squirrel? Boogie boogie boo! Boogie boogie boo! Boogie boogie boo! Boogie boogie boo! Oh boogie boogie boo!